Hi everyone, you are this is Coins Kid. Just going to jump into DGB. Uh, did you buy DGB versus USD? Uh, full disclosure: this is a little uh, altcoin that I've been acquiring for a very long time now. Um, I've been buying this since way down here. Uh, the previous uh, pre-cycle I've just been accumulating this I don't trade it I just keep uh, dollar cost averaging into it always have been and always will be it's a great little project and what I like about this project as well it's not like you new kids on the block this has actually been around the block okay it's, I think it was first came around in 2013 I think I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'm not quite sure to be honest with you but I, I got in round about here okay and I've just been accumulating I'm not looking to sell I'm not looking to trade like I said to you the best thing you can do in this space is dollar cost average okay so I do see more potential upside for this particular project it is an evolving project it is you know you have to look at Metcalf's law and the network growth that it's going through it is a, a very serious project indeed um, so do pay attention to it uh, it's called Digibyte uh, again not financial advice it's a little altcoin gem of mine and um, yeah so in in 2020 last year it created the the golden cross and the buy and go to the reach signal from coins kid here and ever since then it's been holding structural support and we've been moving up in these waveforms ever since look look uh, i'm sorry ever since we've been doing something like this like this boom 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 you see a beautiful waveform continuation i do expect us to see a bit more appreciation in this bull run okay it, obviously it is a big if as well if we do get the continuation if we do get the continuation of the bull run there is a, a upper price projection up there for you that i will show you in a minute you can see that the volume is starting to pick up here especially on the selling side because we've been sort of tailing off so to speak of this selling pressure that, that dg's been, been under you create a beautiful double bottom here on the weekly time frame i mean look at that yeah that's that's always indicative of a bit of a trend reversal and we start to see that trend reversal right now it doesn't mean that we can't enter a bear market here for dgb that is a complete possibility where you can come up make a, a, a high there come back down and start to make these lower highs and then lose support and enter a bear market you're fully aware but if that time comes i I'll tell you in a bear market but so far I'm not seeing that at the moment I'm seeing potential more upside I'm, I'm, I'm potentially seeing a, a bit of a good year end to be honest with you for crypto but again I've not got a crystal ball you know and um, what I'm going to do is show you right now the last bull market that we went through for DGB we had this sort of blow off top here we came back down everyone were getting scared thinking we were entering a bear market but one thing here that told me there wasn't entering a bear market here and this is something I'm anticipating is this level here okay look at this level so we effectively rolled over here and this is what I said to you about bear markets and bull markets okay the structural support that these projects hold so look you came up you came down you create a level of support for yourself you came up you made a, a lower high okay but then you came back down you start to make higher highs you see that but then you rolled over a little bit this in itself is bullish you just say you did start to lose this foundation of support but you'd already printed this signal here which is a high higher than that so you're just retesting support and you came back and you had that parabola mania blow off top right there which is what i'm waiting for okay which is what i'm anticipating here for crypto where we start to come down and we come up and we make the lower highs okay look at that that's your bear market and you lose structural support boom confirmation of a bear market when you start making these lower highs look a higher high you made a low lower high but then you made a higher high so you effectively you're reversing right here so you know there is the anticipation here that we're just like going to melt up and, and, and continue into space personally i don't see that i don't think that we are going to melt into space i do think that we are going to come up against resistance you know and you will roll back to a key level of support but if we can start making the higher highs like this okay this is your your confirmation you're already seeing it just here you're already seeing it just here especially on the daily for dgb i mean look at this for dgb okay so look you, you've bottomed out you created your double bottom just there look beautiful double bottom at play and then you start to come up here and you roll you're doing these beautiful waveforms like this for dgb see this so you're making higher highs and you're always resting on the previous swing high this is an uptrend okay this is confirmation of an uptrend you're getting them above dmas you're starting to drag the 20 over your shoulder and with a 55 boom and go to the reach signal from coins kid so if you're looking for an entrance in for to, to dgb again not financial advice but you know personally it's what i tell all my subscribers it's looking good it's looking great but you know you could roll back here if if you want to get confirmation of this uptrend because look it's beautiful yeah so what you want to do is see the golden cross out okay get the buy and go to the beach signal on coins kid come up get overextended roll back to it as support hold that as support there's your entrance point and your confirmation statement of a trend reversal and an uptrend continuation for dgb 
because right now I'm going to show you potential price targets moving forward okay so switch back to the weekly time frame here uh, personally I think that what we're going through in this bull market is a two-part bull market and you know th this particular previous cycle high here where it came up in the mid 2017 which I remember very well look exactly the same price uh, timeline in in May there we got a blow off top come back down start to correct have a correction just there in, in sort of May 2017 uh, latter part of May there came down everyone screaming bear market consolidated and then start to pick up for that final leg just there do you see that so this is what I'm anticipating for a year end a very similar scenario to that so just off the bat we're going to do as a four experiment is go from this local high here to this local high there and I'm going to drop it in here like that and you can see we've gone through this corrective phase and right now you can see the potential is up there roughly 40 cents for DGB okay that's a potential play for DGB if we can hold these key level support create this double bottom and find support off it and come up that you're looking at a 40 cent DGB token and using Fibonacci just here okay just lay that down you could see look that's your confirmation that you get a little bit of extended and you're potentially looking at a 1618 uh, 51 cent um, DGB token from here it's not going to be easy you probably roll back and retest this at some point but eventually you know this is where we do see uh, DGB coming to 51 cents in this bull run so again not financial advice and it is all theory and it is technical analysis so nothing I say is financial advice or an absolute positive that it's going to happen but so far you are doing to structural support I would definitely like to see yourself get back above the, the 20 on the weekly and start to get through these key levels of resistance right here because that is our primary target in this bull run for DGB a 1618 at 51 cents okay so from here right now if it was to go on and appreciate you could be looking at a beautiful uh, where are we a beautiful 810 percent uptrade for uh, DGB in this bull market okay so that's basically it you know and uh, you know I'd like to see another extension of that to be honest with you but that is the, the foundation technical analysis at the moment for the next impulsive wave up for DGB and, and if we get there and start to retrace you know I'll lay down the fibs again and, and see where our support levels are but that is our target target in this bull run providing we hold support and, and don't go any lower than this particular level here at 0 0.03241 and we bottomed out here which we are showing real good strength and, and signs that we bottom out but do expect some waveforms okay it's not going to go like this oh it's going to go straight in a straight line it's not going to do that don't be disillusioned it's going to be frustrating it's going to make you want to sell but it, it's a long game all of this crypto is a long game that's why it's best to just dollar cost average okay Take care, everyone. That's a little update and a price prediction for DGB moving forward, providing we can hold support and, and break up now against key levels of resistance. You know, a confirmation statement here is getting above this particular level just there, the 0618, because with that, you're starting to form this impulsive wave like this. Impulsive wave, break that level of resistance. You're looking at high possibility coming up breaking the high and with that you're looking at them extensions up there to the price appreciation for DGB in this bull run towards the latter part of this year okay providing we don't look, go any lower than that take care everyone back tomorrow with an update on DGB stay healthy stay strong stay tuned bye bye